guys, it's me. Welcome back to my channel. Oh my gosh, it feels so good to film for you guys again. But anyways, today I thought I would do kind of a different kind of video. Today I thought I would share with you guys products that I stuck up. Now, to be honest, there's no reason for me to stock up on any product really because not only do I love to you know buy and test out new products all the time, see what's new in the market, but I also get a lot of PR gifts as well. So there's always an ample amount of products for me to test out. However, there are certain products I do like to stock up just because I love them so much. <laughs> it's actually a very short list. It's only four products. So let's get started out. It's hot guys. It's hot. I'm sweating again. This is not good. The first product I love to stock up on is the Thank You Farmer True Water Deep Serum. Goodness gracious, I've used a lot of these products. I've actually lost count to how many bottles or products I've used because I went through a lot of them. So. <laughs> The weather is indeed getting colder, which means it's time to take out this serum. Actually, this used to be a product that I always returned to when like the seasons got colder just because I had oily skin. But as you guys know, I have more of a drier skin now. So I ended up using a whole bottle throughout the summer. I just slapped that on and I was good to go. It was enough hydration. So even though before it was definitely something I stocked up on during like the autumn, winter seasons, now I just stuck it up. All the time. I honestly think that, you know, it's one of those serums or one of those products actually where you know that when they first made it, they actually put a lot of thought into it. And it wasn't just like they made the serum just so that they can make profit. It feels like a product, actually, all of these products that I'm gonna show you feel that way, but this also feels like a product where people actually took the time to make sure it's a good product. That is one thing that I really started to appreciate about a lot of products just because now I get to test out a lot of products. Products, right the thing that I love about the serum is that I love the formulation it seeps right in and there's nothing like dwelling on top it just really does the job in hydrating your skin it's there to do what it came to do so even as I'm applying on the back of my hand it absorbs right in and I also think it's a perfect product for the transitional period like in Korea we have the Hanjagi period where in the summer it got it's like really really hot and then now it's becoming more chilly and drier so during that transitional period our skin can you know of course it's, it's gonna go through some changes so I think this is a great product to use and also I've had a lot of people tell me that this helped a lot with the small little bumps that come on your forehead like chopsal in Korean we say so those little bumps occur because your skin lacks hydration and they're not acne per se but they're just like little ones that you can't really seem to squeeze anything but then they won't go away and they don't look too flattering for your texture i think when i had oilier skin type this did feel heavy for me to use in the summer but now that i have dry skin it feels perfect for me even in the summer and in the winter i can layer this on with using other products as well so this is just a very all-around good product that I highly recommend and that I do stock up on. Actually, I have a backup right here. This is a, another product that I bought. Another product that I want to show with you guys is this Abi Quick Sunstick. Now, to be honest, this is kind of like an exception because it's not a product that I stuck up on, but it is already my third product because I think I mentioned this to you guys before, but when I really am passionate about a certain product and I think it's really good, not only do I, of course, recommend it to you guys, but I end up like giving it to all of my friends and family. I'm like, you have to try this because it's so good. So my first two I had given away. I, I gave my first one to Yunyan I gave my second one to Sarah who's in Singapore right now. And so this is indeed my third one. This is a sun stick that I specifically keep in my bag or pouch so that I can reapply it on my hands or on my neck. It is a product that I use really well, especially in the summer because we're all wearing short sleeves. So I wanted to reapply a sun cream on my body as well and this was perfect because I feel like sprays, they're convenient, but they can be a little invasive and kind of like uh, inconvenient when there are other people around because first the smell could be really bad for them or you could get some on them. So I feel like this is the perfect way to reapply sun cream on your body when you're outside. Even when I'm at home, I'll just take this and slap this on my skin because it's really, it goes on really, really smooth. So with sunstick, I try not to use one that drags because I don't want to pull or tug at my skin. So this is just the right amount of that smoothness or the butteriness, but it's not oily. I think that was the most important thing for me. If it's oily or feels sticky, especially on my body, that is definitely something that we do not want. But this one, after you absorb it and patted it, it like goes away. The feeling that you've put on anything 
goes away. So I think they aced it with the formulation. It's really convenient to use, no stickiness. And of course, the design is ever so sleek. I think Abib is definitely one of those kind of like Insta Gamesong in Korean, I would say. One of those products where they kind of give off that really kind of cool vibe. So I mean, the packaging is great, it's convenient, and the large surface area makes it so convenient to swipe the product on your body ever so quickly. So this is indeed my third one and I highly recommend. And I'm also gonna get another one just so that I can keep one in my bag and one in my house because I've noticed that I like using this while I'm at home, but then if I keep it in my bag, I have to take it out. It's kind of inconvenient. So I'm gonna grab myself another one, but I highly recommend this one. Definitely. The third product that I do like to stock up on, and yes, you have indeed guessed it, it is the Relash Real Hyaluronic Bio Couch and Blue Solution. Ah! I can already feel you guys rolling your eyes at me because I've mentioned this like so many times. But it's just that good. And like I said, guys, I've been giving this out to like all of my friends and family because I want them to see how good it is. And nine out of 10 people have told me that it's really good. They really like it, so they end up buying it again for themselves. So it's a product that I love to stock up on. And actually, just because I stocked up on it so much, I've actually stopped because I have so many and I actually need to use them. Of course, I like to buy the 10 piece kit, like I always mention, because not only is it more affordable, but it's also more environmentally friendly because if you buy the individual package ones, there's so many unnecessary packaging that I feel really, really guilty so I prefer using these instead and of course I do get PR gifts from them from time to time which I love it's like my favorite PR gift ever and they're like really an SOS kit for me like if I know tomorrow's gonna be like an important day where I I want my skin to look good and feel good then this is definitely a product that I will use like the day before and also on that day I mean you guys probably saw this coming but we'll launch the Willa Hyaluronic one day kit is definitely a product I love and I stuck up on and I highly recommend. So yeah. All right, I should probably explain to you guys what this product is. I'm sorry. So for those who are new to my channel or haven't seen this product before, basically this is more like a one-time use capsule. So here you have the hyaluronic ball, which is a dried ball of hyaluronic acid. And then you have the solution in which you mix them together and you kind of make this concoction and you apply it on your face. The reason why I love this so much is that it really plumps up your skin and hydrates it really, really, really well. I do think that if you have oily skin, this is going to feel a little heavy for you, but if you have like combination dry skin, um, go for it. And like I said, this makes your skin look like it had 10 hours of sleep, even though if you had like three hours of sleep. Instead of coffee, you can grab this. The downside is of course, first, it is pricey. One of these do retail 5,000 to 6,000 won, which is uh, a pretty expensive, I will mint and also there's so much packaging like I said this is a one-time use and for a one-time use I just feel like there's a lot of unnecessary packaging so that is something I did say mention to the brand managers I was like are you guys maybe considering to change the packaging to make it less hazardous and they said in the future they definitely will so let's keep our fingers crossed for that because this is a definitely a product that I do want to keep on repurchasing but yeah <laughs> Last up, I have these Abib Gummy Sheet Mask Heart Leaf Sticker and Metacastocyte Stickers. And these are already super, super popular and with a very good reason, I must say. So I've been trying out a lot of sheet masks lately. I've been doing one sheet mask per day. And I think this is one of the sheet masks that's very suitable for that kind of use. And also, I always take these out with me when I go travel. I feel like when you are abroad, just because you're more tired and like the climate is different, the food is different, the water is different, your skin does feel a little more rough than usual and it's not in its best condition or like state. So I always like to take these out with me when I go abroad and use it every single night. First of all, the quality of the sheet mask itself is really good. Like I wouldn't say it's necessarily the thinnest, but it sticks onto your face ever so tightly and holds on. So I feel like because of that, it does feel it's a bit more thinner than it is and it doesn't irritate my skin at all. You guys know my skin does react to specific specific materials like if the material is rough I will get like reactions like bumps but this doesn't happen to me at all and there's so much essence in it like I'll, there's a lot in it guys so I feel like after I use this my skin feels really rested really hydrated and really well pampered now the downside of these as well is of course these are a bit 
pricier. Have you guys noticed that a lot of the sheet mask prices have gone up? Like before they used to be like 1000 won or like 1000 won and like 2000 won, one to two dollars. Nowadays it's like minimum like 4000 won or something. Like most of them are 5000 won each and I'm just like uh, that's hella expensive. So I always like to get them when they're on sale or something like that. But I do think that they are kind of worth the buck because <laughs> The quality of these are really really good and I kid you not so I like to buy them in boxes like this so they have 10 each and I kid you not I have six boxes in my room right now because I was stocking up on these but I do think that these are really really good so that was it for this video it was a pretty short one but these products are definitely ones that I do stock up on as you guys saw <laughs> let me know what is your favorite product and what product which product you love to stock up on I would love to read because I feel like that really shows that you actually enjoy the product and you are repurchasing them all the time so let me know in the comments down below which product you would love so I can check them out myself but yeah uh, don't forget to like this video subscribe if you never if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in the next ciao